Oh, ooh, ammo detonation. We are as lucky as we all saw that. Suicide run onto us. We should be able to finish him off pretty quickly though. But they are going to head to us. Ooh, there he goes. Suicide run onto us. We should be able to finish him off pretty quickly though. But they are going to head to us. Ooh, there he goes. Victory is ours. Sink him. Pumping it back out. Bang. That's it. Victory is ours. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome, everyone. It is good to be back. Well, 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 welcome. And uh, we're going to continue our campaign in the amazing Ultimate Admirals Dreadnoughts. We'll get straight into it. We'll get a bit of an overview. I've only skipped ahead one turn since our last episode. There was a couple of small battles. We lost a, a small, a light cruiser. It was one of our new ones and I uh, wasn't happy with that. But thank you all for joining me again. And if you enjoy this content, don't forget to subscribe and like. And uh, yeah, throw some comments in there as well if you wish uh, for uh, about this uh, naval battle simulator. So... I've got a couple of battles to go through, but uh, as I just said, I skipped ahead a turn or two and there was a battle and I had took out the Dingo class uh, for the first time and I wasn't happy with it. Uh, we've got a couple, I think, being built at the moment, which will keep them going, but uh, I want to build another one. So we'll go in, always exciting to get into a battle to start off with, and then uh, we will come out of that and build a ship because I don't think these battles will take too long. We have our new class or one of our new class uh, heavy or armoured uh, cruisers, an EMU-1 against uh, the Imperius. Oh, well, a 35, so they're pretty much equal. Or we've got a convoy where we're quite, well, two light cruisers, which will probably be torpedo, quite uh, full of torpedoes, where these aren't any of the, that I've designed. These are old ones. So we could use this to clean up if we sink, we sink, big deal. We, we're sort of outclassing the British, but they've had a new a battleship off the line, haven't they? They've got a CLCA, uh, we've got a repair, repair, repair. So they're still, they're still way, way behind, but they are quickly catching us. I have a lot more ships in production. So, let's get on with the show. We're going to go with the equal, nice and easy fight. Here we go. Equal match. Equal match. Equal match. Who's going to outclass who? Let's skip right ahead and get this battle started. You'll join me back when we find the enemy. Okay, we have found the enemy and we are inbound. So let's have a look. Who has the biggest? They're about the same. So they're both the same. This doesn't have our newer class torpedoes on board. We have researched them though. So we could put out a new ship with those on there, which would be quite handy. So maybe we do refit all our new ships with our new class of torpedo. Now we'll change straight over because he will probably be quite heavily armoured. There he is. Interesting how this one's going to pan out. They're quite equal ships. Obviously we're not on the best angle for a torpedo launch at the moment. Side by side is what we want, but what I'm planning to do is to come around and we'll turn around and go down to the right side. So I don't want him to launch, but I don't want him to 
waste. We've only got four. He's probably got two. So we want him to waste his torpedoes more than us. We've been hit. We're very equal, except they've got more bulkheads than us, I think. So could hurt. Alright, we're going to start to see what his reaction is as we come around and he gets close to our, in the torpedo range. Come on, we've got to land some of these. We've only got green sailors on board. I'm going to try to keep ahead of his torpedo range. Looks like he's got faster reload as well. Let's see what happens on this. He'll outmaneuver us if we launch a torpedo now, but it will put him in. Uh, we're also in his torp range. I knew he would launch and that would give us an idea to launch around here. This could be, no, we we'll missed that by a mile. Damn, it's exactly what we didn't want. Bloody now. And we've got to reload our torpedo. So we're going to see if we can maneuver back. Pump that out and get our speed back up. But so far, not very good. He'll follow us. He's going to have the speed on us now. Got the upper hand. Pumping the water out now. Gotta wait for that torpedo to reload. And water is pretty much out. Lucky. Full speed are back. But we have not landed a shot. Oh! Ooh, ammo detonation. We are as lucky as... We all saw that. Well, that's the luck of uh, rock, paper, scissors, isn't it? Uh, unfortunately, that uh, is the end of that battle that I thought was going to be tough. I'll take it. I will take it. So as promised, uh, we've just taken out one of his heavy cruisers just like that with some minor damage. Uh, we're going to go in and do this build. Uh, just going to double check. Let's go uh, build a ship. No, we don't want to build that ship. Do, 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 do. I hope I didn't put that ship. No, 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 no. I want to cancel. I can't. I can't. I haven't. Scrap. All right. Uh, we are going to build a new design. We're going to copy the dingo. So we want to copy you. We want to delete you. We want to see if we can update the torpedoes. And I'm actually happy also. Well, we can't. Uh, let's just start from scratch. Uh, let's delete you. Go up. Let's delete you. Let's start a new light. And what can we do? First of all, I just want to get these torpedo tubes straight in there. 
so they already got the 15 inch. Can we? We can go to 16 inches. All right, cool. Do we really need one on the back? All right, so are they all 15s now? I'm at a 16 inch, good. I don't really need to waste weight on the rear one. Uh, we'll see what our weight's like. What are we sitting at? What? We're already sitting at... That's nuts. Let's uh, bring you back. We don't need much range. We want to bring you up slightly. Can't do anything there either. Alright, bring you back. For a moment. We're just a hit and run. Let's throw in a secondary. I want to get a good tower. Get some good range. But where does that put our weight at? Damn. Alright, we'll take the rear and put that as a slider one. We only need some minor... Minor, minor, minor weaponry. Turrets. Don't want anything huge. So main gun, 7 inch, 51. Well, maybe put the front gun. And let's go... A couple of 6 inches. Want to get right on the end. That's it. That works. How does that look? That looks good. And we haven't got much range. We've got the torps is what we want. So we can put a couple of four inch ones on deck. Can't get up there. How about remove this? And we put some. Where they go in the front. Yeah, we could do those. They're a bit more protected. But it's not a light. At least we've got the bulkheads. Uh, we need to get. Mm. We, oh, you know what? We can... There we go. Compound armor. So that's better protection. Hulls the same. Hulls... That's going to be heavy. Not much more heavy, though. So that saved weight going to our compound armor. So we can probably... Pop you up there. It could probably pop a bit more speed. We can throw some more guns. Alright, and... Do we grab... Main guns. Can we get a couple of 5-inch guns anywhere? How heavy are they? 21. We could do two. It's not got any... Back to four inch. Alright. So, what about the threes? Yep. Yep. So I can't put any of these. Four inches anywhere. Oh, yes, they go. They work. It's just the five inches I can't. Alright. They do work well, so, and they're only eight, so we can put two there, two there, and we've got some, Ooh, five, five, we've got enough, yep. No, don't, it won't go anywhere, it won't go anywhere, that's it, that's where we're going, still got a hundred, 
Up a bit more speed. Right, right, ah, that's what I wanted. Uh, 23. All right, no. 22.5, close. 22.8. So we can't do 22.3. 23, no, nah, so we're gonna to have to go 22.9, yep. That's what we have. Can we actually type this in? We can't type that in it. Ah, damn. All right. Good, 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 good. I'm happy with that. I don't think we've got anything extra here though. We haven't researched anything. Uh, ooh, increase the torpedo round. That's uh, something is tempting. Then we're going to bring you back to 22.5, probably. 22.7. 22.6. All right, I'm happy with that. I am naming you. Got an idea. Got an idea. Something that is fast. And it's a bit of a crazy animal. You can guess it. The cassowary. There we go. Oh, that didn't work. Didn't it work? Cassowary. There we go. That's, and we'll just name it uh, Series 1, I guess. I don't know if we'll go to another series on it, but we'll uh, do that. And that's the f name of the first one. So let's do that and save design oh no someone should have told me i had no funnel that was why we had plenty of uh weight in no weight issue that's a bummer all right we need to uh take you down to short range we'll get you somewhere close so where i'm going to situate this is uh pretty close to the channel oh that's not right it's going to be 22.6 22.5 all right now i'll save you all righty so have we put one of those into action no we haven't so We'll grab two of you. And I know exactly where you're going to go. You're going to go. We go to world. We're going to put you two down here. So we don't have the range. So we'll put them in here and then we can move them. So yeah. what do we got here? We've only got a couple of no lights. So we'll put them in there. Put them both there. We need to work out where we're going to put all these. Put them all in the area so we can block down the channel. Now, I think we've got... Got enough there. We have three battleships there. We don't really need three battleships there. We have four battleships here. We don't really need four battleships there. Uh, let's move. Can I pick what I want to move? All right, cool. Let's move Wombat. Is it not going to be used much? What have you got? That's, that's got another battleship. And then we'll try to move. Oh, no, we'll keep those there. It's light, it's light. We'll keep those there. Okay. Cancel. All right. Uh, go back to fleet, world fleet. We will put in two battleships. We're going to have battleships there. 
and boom, we've got fleece, and and then we've got two. So we need more over here as well. So we've only got a heavy. Okay, so go to fleet. Uh, get some of these. Oh, don't doesn't that come up? Oh, it is. Yep. So we've got a lot of torpedo boats. We're gonna get them all here. And we've got some tor two torpedo boats. So put one in. Oh, we're gonna need a couple in for a minute. Okay. That'll set us up now. Uh, one in there. We'll move once once we get these. We're going to move these once they're all built. We'll move them across over to here. Let's go. All right, that's it. We've got a ship built, and we've had. We're going into our first battle. Let's go. We had a lucky battle, and we're going to go in for this one before the end of the episode. And here we go. We're going for a win. We're going for a win. Oh, we can already see them. I was going to say we skip ahead. What's our weather looking like? We've got a clear day. Okay, we are back in the battle. Here we go. So we've lit them all up. We've got a lot of uh, candles burning. And uh, we have one, two, three on fire. They actually hit us a nasty one in the back. So we've just sunk one. We haven't found their escort yet. So we're doing all right. We're going to move it back up to full speed. And we're going to see if we can finish them all off. But we're going to get in close, so we want these sunk pretty quickly. I'm going to see if we can sink you pretty quickly. Before you come and do a suicide run onto us. We should be able to finish him off pretty quickly, though. But they are going to head to us. Ooh, there he goes. And here we go, we've got them firing, so their escorts have now found us. And remember, I think they're light cruisers that uh, we're up against, maybe. But we sunk a couple. We should be able to sink you quite easily. You are going down all over. Good. He might be able to scoot around the back here. Alright. How do we look? How do we look? We look pretty much on fire. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Really chasing one more down. And then we'll go on and see if we can hit their escorts. Are you firing at? Oh, good. Another one down. One more to go. And then we're going after their escorts. Let's, let's 
We're getting close. We've got a sink you. Let's go that way. We should have that last escort is done. Mission accomplished. Killed 100% of transports. Beautiful job. Haha. -ha. But we want the escorts. They don't get away. So let's now speed ahead. Until they're a little closer. We'll be back when we're close to their escorts. They might bug out though. Alright, we're back. It's getting too uh, heated already. We are now already got the archer. We can sink these two. We are well and truly ahead in this battle. We just need to keep damaging. Now remember, they got the torpedoes, which are still quite out of range. We actually might be able to come across these direction and stay out of range. He's dead in the water at the moment. Once we can steady up, we should be able to. Good. Gotta watch that the AI doesn't take over here and push us into him like he's doing now. Get out of here. He's pushing us there. We should have him. That's it. We should have him. Can't survive much longer. Ooh, that's it. Done deal. Let's go after the last. Beautiful, beautiful work. He's already on fire. So we've absolutely decimated them today. First battle, won. Second battle, about to win. I just don't want to lose any ships because that's what's going to help us out because the British are going to start... They've got heaps on the production line, so any moment now or any turn, we're going to start getting all their new ships off the production line. Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch your... Watch it, watch it. We should be just... Got to get you around... All right, we're in luck. We must be so close into his range. He could turn into us and launch one. He knows we don't have torpedoes. That's it. Flooding has happened. We are doing well. All right, let's go straight across. Steve, we got him. He's finished. That's it. Victory is ours. Sink him. Pumping it back out. Bang. That's it. Victory is ours. Ladies and gentlemen, we have done it again outstanding victory exactly like that picture is we did it two battles won and again our war victory points is huge so we've dropped them now down to 13 
light cruisers, heavy cruisers. Still got six. We took out one. Lots of torpedo boats. They could send those all to our battleships and probably sink them. Uh, but that's it. Uh, we scrapped a ship, an old ship, and no, oh, what happened here? Let's have a look what's happened in here. But, well, look at that. We've mothballed the emu. Oh, no, we scrapped that. That's right. We built the wrong one. All good, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm going to leave it there. We are well on our way. Let's go and have a look at the uh, new ship that is on. We view. Uh, how do we view our shipyard? Go to our ship design. Go to our ship and view this. So here's our newest ship off the production line. It's going to be a hit and run ship. A light cruiser. It's got the speed. It doesn't really have the range though. But that doesn't matter because it's going to be close to the channel. Uh, or on the channel. And it doesn't need the range. It's a hit and run ship. It's going to have our 16 inch torpedoes. So the range uh, is going to be further than the current British technology. So that's what we're going to be using. So see you later. And like always everyone, I will see you all on the other side.